Hello everybody, uh, Typhlosion Corner over here with uh, my uh, lovely assistant as always, uh, Amy. And uh, as you can see right here, she's sporting a new uh, shirt, which I got her for her yesterday. It's a Harry Potter shirt. Uh, this is uh, waiting for my uh, letter to Hogwarts, as you can somewhat make out right there on the bottom part of uh, the shirt. And I was very happy to get it for her, because like, it's just that, uh, you know, it's been a while since I've really gotten her anything. Considering the fact that uh, for a Snorlax there really isn't much to anything other than the robe and the cap thing that you get a Build-A-Bear for the Snorlax for uh, Build-A-Bear. So at the very least I was able to find one shirt for her which I'm really happy about. You know at the very least she also likes it as well. And uh, for both of us uh, we got uh, we're happy to be doing another one of our reviews. And that um, for today we got a, uh, another non-Pokemon uh, Build-A-Bear. I really want to diversify with what uh, you guys hold on of what you guys see in my uh, channel. So uh, this one is another one of my animal ones. Uh, this one's also a older model of uh, what they have now. If I, if anything, if they still have it, because I can't remember if they replaced it with other stuff. More or less because of the Merry Mission stuff still being out and whatnot, and some of the newer arrivals and whatnot. Um, so to the majority part, everybody, uh, before I begin my uh, review. I'd like to say that, um, that if anything, uh, I am going to start somewhat trying to do each week, uh, card unopenings and whatnot for Pokemon cards. I haven't really able to do anything from yesterday or Friday more because, uh, the only time I was off, uh, towards the end of the week was, uh, Saturday in which I tried looking for whatever for Think Geek in which they were all sold out other than, like, make a few things, but majority of them being, like, certain things, like, you only get, like, well, one being a booster box, which is around, like, 20-something dollars, or, like, 30 dollars, something like that, and the other thing being, uh, this thing where it's just more of the stuff you would need for the, if you're playing the card game, which I really don't do, anyway, um, so, if anything, hopefully it's soon to be doing a lot more of that stuff, I'll do, like, more tens, like how I have this one right here, with the Charizard one for Hidden Fates. Maybe I'll see if I can get another one of these. Or at the very least, other than that, I'll try to see if I can get another one of these big, these small tin things. Where it's got the two card packs and then, like, you know, the cards and whatnot. So, I'm kind of hoping to be doing a lot more of that type of stuff uh, in the near future and whatnot. And also, too, to be maybe doing some more of the stop motion animation. I'm still trying to figure out, if, like, what I can work in for a schedule type thing to be doing uh maybe like three videos per week i'm not entirely sure 100 percent if i am going to be doing this you know weekly it might be just randomly i am not entirely sure but i'm really trying to do a lot more for my channel per week than what i have been doing which was at the beginning part at least towards the end of this year was just doing more of uh build a bear videos and that was usually it so with that uh being said that i'm hoping to do a lot more so um and with that uh, out of the way, now I can do my uh, review, which, as you can see, I got a new, uh, well, not really new, it's one of my older Build-A-Bears. Uh, it's an older model, but if anything, not something like how Rudolph was, which was like something that, you know, I don't think you're ever going to have again, so. Here is Elvis, my elephant. Uh, he got, was got around uh, 2015, around the time that I was uh, working for McDonald's as a maintenance person. Uh I still remember around the time that I got him, he was uh, one of my grief bears, uh, or at least something I wanted to get around the time, because uh, uh, it was a very sad time around, because uh, it was something like, uh, this is around the time that like uh, working at McDonald's was starting to uh, get very, uh, getting very emotional for me, because like all the stuff they wanted me to do, like a lot of stuff was, was, uh, was, uh, you know, of, of what I, uh, what they wanted me to do, I had a lot of stuff to do and a lot of time to not so much time to do each particular point, and then they really wanted stuff quick, fast, and in a hurry, which technically it wasn't really a right thing to do in the in the fourth place. Because considering, like you know, I'm trying my best, trying to do everything. Not only with that, like how you know, because like where the the stuff they cook the um, food and whatnot, and like it, it's hard trying to move around with certain things, especially with how they had certain things you know, uh, ordered around and whatnot, you know, it's just, it's hard trying to do all this stuff with trying to be, you know, on the fly with a lot of things and whatnot, but 
to the most part, I had a bad day uh, around the time that I got Elvis here. And uh, I was actually, I don't know if I either heard about uh, them having the old giraffe, a uh, whole, yeah, not giraffe, um, an elephant, sorry, you know, being on display or anything, or I can't remember if that, or if I remember seeing it, and I think also, too, uh, when I got this one, uh, I noticed, uh, something else that my brother would like, which, uh, was around the time when they had the T-Rex, and I can't remember if they had another one, I think there was, like, two dinosaurs, but I think I remember seeing the T-Rex where it was... A build a bear, but it also has like a little hand puppet thing for the mouth and whatnot. So I don't know if why if they were just doing something for like T Rexes with puppets and whatnot at that particular point in time. But for the most part, that I uh, it was a bad day for my uh, work at work anyway, and that I uh, wanted to get something just to you know help me blow some steam and if anything to uh, forget about the day. So that's when I got Elvis here, which he's very soft, very plush. He's a very huggable one. Uh, I kind of like how, you know, his, like, with his, uh, you know, his nose here with, uh, I think he's about to spray somebody with water, his little cute little ears and whatnot, and his mouth and whatnot looks so cute, looks a lot more, like, you know, uh, elephant-like in this one, because, uh, for the newer one, uh, they kind of downgraded the, the trunk of his, uh, face, um, his ears are somewhat, I think, are a lot smaller, I think, or about around the same size, and he's a lot darker than how he is for this one, for the um, you know, for the older model and whatnot, um, I am somewhat trying to, because I, uh, when they had the thing for when they debuted the elephant in stores, they had, like, a little safari outfit, would, which would be kind of cool to get for my, uh, elephant here, for Elvis, uh, he's also one of the, uh, very few Builder Bears that actually did a, uh, that I actually did a last name for, his name, his full name is supposed to be Elvis Everhart, and, uh, you know, it's just a really cute, you know, cause I, another thing, too, I really like elephants, too, which I was really happy to get him, because I do like elephants. Um, but once again, since this is an older model of the elephant, uh, you know, you really can't find him, other than maybe, like, I would say, like, eBay or whatever. You wouldn't really be able to find something like this in, uh, you know, in store, other than it being the newer model and whatnot. The only thing I'm surprised about that they don't have anything like, uh, like tusks or whatever. Even in the new model and whatnot, they don't have a tusk thing, you know, like little pointy things coming out of the mouth right here. Unless it's only a certain, you know, age or whatever of, uh, you know, Build-A-Bears and whatnot that has the tusks. But for the most part, you know, I'm very happy to have him as my collection. And at least, you know, especially with, what, what, hold on, with wildlife, um, you know, uh, my, uh, collection of wildlife, uh, build a bears um as i said before very great material very soft very plush very huggable a nice great uh friend to be holding when you're sleeping and whatnot and very cute uh once again another and he's also another one on with the generation of the paw and whatnot um i mean other than that i can just say that you know he's a really great bear not really much to him i mean just because you know you know being an elephant and whatnot I'm really happy to have him as my collection, as I do everybody that I have, both Stuffy and Build-A-Bear. And uh, we all here uh, all appreciate our uh, family, my Stuffy family, and everything. And that, uh, you know, just that he's an all-around really great guy. You know, at the very least, especially in a, at, at the time that I got him, I was really down in the dumps with work and whatnot. And then he helped me uh, at least get over it as, as soon as I would be getting off from that horrible job of mine it was just such a bad job i mean it's just because i need the money and whatnot and i thought it was a lot like you know be a great opportunity to work at a place that i've been through for many years and whatnot or at least to the particular point before they started going seasonal now because that one that i have over here where i live is a seasonal mcdonald's so they only open during around the summer and a little bit towards fall and whatnot and they end up closing towards the end of it so um other than that, I really don't have really much else to say about my uh, Build a Bear Elvis here, but just to say that you know he is a great Build a Bear, and if you can get him, I would highly recommend getting him if you can from like eBay or anything else you could possibly get for Build a Bears and whatnot. So with that in mind, guys, thank you guys all for watching my video, and I'm sorry for if this is one uh, is a little confusing. It's kind of hard to really say anything more about my uh, elephant here. As not really much else is really to be said about you know, him, because like you know, not 
you know, like it's more of like how old he is and, uh, you know, certain stuff I could possibly say about him. So, uh, with that in mind, guys, thank you guys all for watching my video. Um, if you have subscribed to my YouTube channel, or if you haven't subscribed to my YouTube channel, actually, um, please do. And if you have subscribed to my YouTube channel, make sure you also hit that bell notification so you get any notifications of present and future videos. If you want to, uh, if you actually, uh, if you like this video, give it a like. If you have any suggestions on what you want to see for my next YouTube video, anything you want to see of my stuffy collection of what you have seen in the me in the background or whatever, or anything at all, make sure you write down in the comment section below. Thank you guys all for watching my video, and I'll see you guys all next time.